it's glad to have you back. My name is Kathy. Good to join me. If you're new to my channel, welcome. And if you like this video, please make sure to do a big thumbs up. And if you'd like to be notified of future videos, please make sure to hit the subscribe button below in addition to the little bell. Uh, today's video is going to be all about the Kat Von D Alchemist holographic palette uh, highlighters and here's the box that it comes in really cute as a bug you can tell this is artwork from Kat Von D and you can see that it is holographic really cute and really innovative doing the little triangle and then here is the actual palette cute as a bug and it is a triangle as well and very nice cardboard with a plasticky kind of a feel to it with raised and if you look real closely you should be able to see a little bit holographic as well on the back she has the information regarding the ingredients which Kat Von D is really good about so let's open up and look at this uh, palette and as you can see really nice packaging open it up really nice magnetic closure and it has a nice little mirror and it flips back and you have four beautiful holographic shades and they are for eye lip and face transformations each shade catches the light from a different angle and gives you that beautiful luminosity each pan has uh, 0.05 ounces or 1.53 grams and there are four shades in this there is the emerald green the sapphire blue the ultraviolet purple sapphire amethyst and then we have the opal pink really nice and we're going to be doing some swatches um, just want to go into a little bit more detail about this that it is completely free of animal testing with no parabens no sulfates and no felatates so just something that you just want to be out there just in case you're really worried about that so let's go ahead and do some swatches on this and I'll put it on the back of my hand. So let's go with this. Here's the emerald green. Really pretty. Look at that. Ooh, look at that. Isn't that phenomenal? And then here's the sapphire blue. Really pretty. Look at that. Ooh, look at that. Just gorgeous. And then we have this, the amethyst ultraviolet really beautiful look at that and then the last one is the opal pink look at those colorings absolutely gorgeous gorgeous colors and they catch the light from different angles which is really different and just want to look at this a little closer and you can see that it's a little chunky on my hand but when you apply it to your face it does not come off that way it comes off as a finely milled um, you know product and when you do use a brush there's a little fallout um, on the brush but you don't get any powdery residue on your face which is an interesting for this formulation uh, i'm just going to let you take a peek at those beautiful colors and look how they absolutely shimmer and they catch the light from different sides the formulation on these are absolutely fantastic feeling them are very very butterly and also you can wear this alone or you can use it over a base uh, you can use it as a highlighter as on your lips and as an eyeshadow so this is really truly an all-over type of palette which is kind of unique and if you are more of a natural person that doesn't like all this glitter um, and this shine and this luminosity make sure this is might not be something for you but believe me this really goes out there with that coloration and it changes with the sunlight which is really amazing especially if you like that wham all over your face coloration and it is absolutely just amazing coloration it's just as i said before but one of the things i want to put out there is that this has been compared to the beverly hills anastasia moonstone palette which has the similar colors um, but they're more of a duo chrome and this is more of a holographic and the pans on these are a little bit smaller than the one on the um, Anastasia Beverly Hills but they are they're not considered dupes but the coloration is very very similar and when you're looking at these in the pan they look quite light but don't let that fool you it is very very pigmented 
Um, also, just want to let you know, I do not have the Moonstone Anastasia palette, um, but you do not need both. And I would strongly urge you that uh, to go into the stores and swatch these both yourself and to see which one you prefer, whether you like the holographic or more of the duo chrome, so that you can find out if this fits into your uh, palette uh, collection um, and just into your lifestyle. But I am love, love, loving this palette. This is something I'm going to be reaching for on a regular basis. And just because, you know, there's, these pans are a little bit smaller, you know, there's something that I should say is that I have never uh, hit the pan on a highlighter uh, before. So I think this is going to last me a long time. And with the multi-uses, you're really going to get bang for your buck, especially for $32. So I highly recommend this. Um, as I said, you do not need to get both both this and the Anastasia Moonstone. If you have both, great, but pick and choose which one's going to best fit your lifestyle. And I hope this video was helpful and have a great day.